wanted to bring the wilderness down here. Mi nombre es Puente y estas pinturas, estos cuadros que ustedes ven aquí, este se llama La Infanta y lo hice porque es una mujer muy buena, una maga buena, que de, si ustedes ven los, los brazos que están así, quiere decir que ella es dadora de vida. La figura femenina para mí es muy importante porque yo vengo de un matriarcado donde mi, la familia de, mi, de mía es está hecha de, de, que, de mujeres trabajadoras, entonces yo tomé la, la figura de mi madre para poder plasmar en el lienzo lo que ella nos dio, lo que ella nos ha enseñado, entonces para mí ella es, es la mujer, es dadora de vida, de vida, de sueños, de ilusiones. ¿Ven los niños que están aquí? Esos, esos son niños que van a ir a, a, al castillo de la alegría, de la felicidad. Uh -huh. Y ella puede hacer transformar eh, pájaros, hombres, animales, en lo que sea, porque ella es, es la, la dadora de la felicidad, de la vida, de la magia. Hi, I'm Chris Leonard, and uh, I, I have several works here at Gallery 409 for uh, a show entitled Strange. Whether or not um, they're normal or strange, I guess this is what I do. And I feel probably more comfortable with the brush doing something than talking about what I did. But I think they're really uh, 1968 or 72 or 85 blogs, uh, you know, reflections of a moment of time, um, autobiographical, narrative, contemplative, um, probably telling for the most part a, a pretty personal story, but really playing a game of some sort as well. So the collection of work here, I guess it varies from ceramic to paintings in, uh, on paper, canvas, uh, acrylic and oil, kind of all over the place, but hopefully uh, inconsistently consistent or vice versa. Um, so like if you zero in on one particular piece, which is a piece on a piece, uh, Billy Ritter, uh, a former Valley artist and I were supposed to collaborate and he left me a canvas that was started and I guess I finished it by covering over his start but I do that to myself quite a bit too and I told him about it so I, I really don't feel too awfully bad. In fact I kind of paid a tribute to Billy in the title calling it uh, Long Gone Billy Ritter Black Hat Boogie because he's a drummer, he's a musician as well and that's a skill that I, I really wish I, I had um, but I don't so I, I can always pretend and imagine um, in paint and I, I guess cats have just been a consistency not because I love them because they're around um, and then being an outsider in the valley and, and not necessarily you know uh, a Midwestern American white guy uh, I can paint cats that are purple green black or blue and people don't bring any cultural bias in it into it um, and, and I like that play with the humanoid cats and the fact I can play around with my name Chris Leonard which I, I've got the pseudonym Lenardsky uh, and Chris Leonard is a, a name that could be a guy's or girl's a, 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 a kid's an old woman's uh, a black guy's uh, a white guy's and, and so all that play on the human condition uh, just seems to to stir around and, and work its way through my life well I guess I've been uh, drawing and it's generally been um, you know portraits and faces since I was a little kid and um, I don't think there was any one moment that I want to be an artist in fact I don't even know exactly you know that's a pretty broad term and I think that's just a part of who I am you know as far as making visuals or making art I would consider myself a, a painter that gets to branch out and work in other mediums and I like that specific specific title a little bit more but once upon a time in fourth grade I made this drawing 
drawing in charcoal or crayon or whatever it was in art class. We had art class, and it was about uh, building a snow fort over the weekend, which usually didn't go very well for me. And this one did, and the art teacher ran it and raved over it. And I think it was the first time I, you know, got lost in something, and it was pretty brutal and, and pretty direct, but the art teacher, I guess, saw the power, and that got my mom jazzed up, and, and she's been a big fan and pushed me and paid for a lot of uh, education and, and paint along the way. Uh, and so maybe it is all about the expression and all about the, the face.